Hi YouTube, it's another FTL video. I have some friends who just kind of mentioned that they were having trouble playing FTL even on easy. And I just figured I'd do like a nice, like with the default ship, just kind of show off like what I, some standard tips for a standard run that help things out. Uh, so the first thing when you're chilling in neutral space here, you're going to want to, this is like your default power load that you want to start with. Um, two engines, because there's no point running the medbay unless someone's in it. Also, this is a personal preference, I like to put the burst laser in front of the Artemis. What this means is that if you only lose one bar of weapon power, it will depower your Artemis and not your burst laser. And I just like that because missiles, you know, I only start with eight. I don't like to have to use them when my weapons are at capacity. Um, so you've got the three subsystems, weapons, shields, engines. Weapons have really kind of consistent usage, so you want to put someone on there. Lustanus, he understands war. Robert's piloting, which uh, it doesn't really make sense, but it's in canon. And then you kind of got the choice if you want to do shields or engines. I waffle back and forth on what experience you want your first guy to get on the human ship. We're going to do shields, just kind of on whim this time. Alright. So we look at our opening system and kind of plan. You want to hit Nebulae, because you want to hit as many systems as you can and still, like, make it out. And I'm going to check my sound settings really fast, because I've had some problems with that in the past. So, uh, bear with me for a second here. Oh, can I not test my systems while I'm running? Oh, uh, we're gonna hope it's correct, then, is what we're gonna do. We're going to pray. <laughs> Alright. And so, uh, so we want to hit all three of these, because it makes the rebels chase, though, which let us just hit more systems while we're exploring. Um, so, we probably want to get, like, here, do some of these, and then take this to... Yeah, it'll be. This is a pretty nice, even system. It'll be easy to hit all the nebulae, and like, we'll have a lot of fine control as we see how close the rebels are getting. Where we could either like go right to the exit, or we could like dick around like this. Uh, this is an option in menu if you want. Like how I hover, I can see the route. It's show beacon path on hover. It's very useful. So we're gonna probably go here. Uh, maybe here if there's a distress beacon. Maybe just do this zigzag. Oh, asteroid fields suck when you live on bar shield. This pirate's gonna attack us. Now, one important thing, probably one of the easiest ways to improve at FTL is look at your opponent's loadout. In this case, they've got this laser. I'm pretty sure it's a one shot, but you don't need to worry about trying to distinguish the exact kind of weapon. You just know the type. They've got a laser and a bomb. Which means that the laser's only gonna hit us when our shields are down. So if we weren't in an asteroid field, this guy would be cake. The, only the bombs would hurt us. And often bombs will like hurt subsystems, but not the hull of your ship, aside from the one damage that you lose if the subsystem dies. So that would be nice, but in an asteroid field, this guy's more dangerous, because we're more likely to have our weapons, our shields down from the asteroids. The asteroids will hit parity with about one bar of shield. Like, if he's not shooting us, the asteroids will pretty much do nothing. So we're going to want to zerg down his weapons. What we're going to do, even though the Artemis fires slightly faster than the burst laser, we're not going to be able to avoid, like, his one hit, probably, regardless. So what we're going to do, we're going to fire the burst laser first and see how well it does. And if it doesn't offline those weapons, we might Artemis. If we can save an Artemis, we will. It's really important to be economical. Okay. See, in that case, we happen to miss twice, so we are going to fire an Artemis to not take a second round of his weapons. But if we had hit all three of those times, we probably would need this. Missed with Artemis, too. Looking lovely. We're going to do the same thing, then. We're going to wait for uh, the burst laser before we commit to a second Artemis. It's a shame no one got trained for that miss. You get trained for misses when you're on engines. Uh, but the pilot does get trained, too. He's already got three, which is really lucky. Whereas Renly is getting trained when the shields come back up instead. All right, let's fire this burst laser. Um, just his laser is up, not his bomb. I'm willing to spend another Artemis to just... Press six. Alright. Well, this is gonna hit, but then... It's missing on both sides here. Okay. And see, now, he's only got his bomb. Fuck it, we're gonna save our now. Now we're gonna just try to offline his shields and kinda let the asteroids do our dirty work for us. Going for shields, like, it's kind of an interesting decision, because, like, yeah, it increases your damage output, but a lot of times, like, there's so many volleys that are gonna happen anyway, it doesn't help that much. But in asteroid fields, Offlining the shield is a lot more useful. Unless you miss a lot. Okay, now it's just his laser up. We're gonna keep trying without using the Artemis or anything now. Just... 
So Surrender, it's worth noting, will tend to be better in terms of the secondaries, fuel missile drone part, but less good for scrap. And in this case, eight missiles is a lot of missiles. We're gonna take their Surrender. We took one bar of damage overall, I went fine. With our 14 missiles, we could even like do this if we wanted to, but I'm not gonna. There's a waste of a jump. We don't need fuel or missiles now, we're really good at those, so we're gonna hit this fork here. Shoot. We could have done it the other order of town, this is just arbitrary win. Okay. Whoa! He has a heavy laser, a beam, and a bomb. So beams are really interesting, because sometimes you'll just be immune to them, just straight out. Where, like, because they, like, won't break shields. So if you've got one bar of shield and they got four of these weak beams, you're invincible to them. But here, this heavy laser can take our shield, and then the pike will tear us apart. It's really bad. We're going to expend an Artemis and a burst laser, and just frag the weapons. It helps that auto assaults don't, like, have any crew members. They're unstaffed, so, like, repairing isn't going to happen. Oh, that came up just in time. We lost, uh, one bar of shield on our med bay. We're going to run the repair it. And now we're fine. Uh, sometimes there are very slow AI repairers on these, but, like, as long as we're not futzing about, we're just effectively immune to this guy now, and now it's just kind of big where we want to fire. We can even, there's an auto-fire function. We're going to turn on here. I almost never use auto-fire, because, you know, strategically it's not useful, but here, when it does This way or the other way, we'll just wait. This way. Sure. Automated message. Take over is when we're trying to die. Okay, so this guy, he's trying to jump away in one of our positions. What's cool? This is a so these heavier-looking lasers. They do more damage, but they have like fewer shots. So in this case, it's gonna hurt a lot, but it's only one. We've got a bar of shield. We are immune to this laser. This laser will not affect us, and the bomb. Which is pretty weak and insignificant. Because we don't worry about his weapons at all. Jump out of fire now. We're just gonna shoot his engine. I don't give a shit about his weapons. We're immune to that laser. It's just the bomb. We'll we'll be fine. So instead we're just gonna shoot this out so he doesn't get away. See? He does that one shot. And comes up. Bomb kills oh, the bomb killed our shield though. What? Fucking unfortunate. Let's use an Artemis then just to be safe. There we go. See? And that's how, like, I wouldn't have used an Artemis, except for the fact that he offlined our... You gotta just pay attention to little things like that. Okay. And now the fleet can't find us. Otherwise, if that had succeeded, it would have, like, sped up how fast the Rebels came for us, which is really bad. So we're gonna let him repair here. Come on, Ridley. Those abs. And then we're gonna just depower engines for a little bit. We have to remember to repower shields. Just to... Get him to full health, and then back. Oh, yeah, another asteroid field, my favorite. Oh my god. This is a sickening. Two of these missiles, like we have, and a heavy laser. So the good news is, okay. This is fucking obscene. We need to put an end to this man immediately. Just all the missiles it takes. This is really dangerous. He could just end our playthrough right here if we fuck around. Him. He gets this one giant volley off regardless. Oh, he missed. Okay, we gotta repair. We gotta repair O2. We got. We dodged the hit on weapons. We shot out. Okay, now we just need to show, shoot his shields, let the asteroids do the rest. And then just as he repairs his weapons, we need to keep cutting them back down to size. So having his shields on a whole lot better. Okay. Oh, that could have gone so much worse. There's a tanker, but you can't see it. I don't know what can. Maybe I should turn it on so you can see my fingers. Beat him so fast we haven't even finished charging the jump. Often when you beat a fight, it instantly charges you, but when there's danger like these asteroids, it doesn't give you that luxury. If our shield had been offline, we could have still died. Now we're going to take our nebula hops that we're so happy with. Uh, this one, 
like is just strictly better for getting out of the nebula because we could choose to go here if we think we can handle it so we're gonna do these three in that order okay so in the nebula our sensors will not function but they advance more slowly so we don't know what's happening on our ship we need to watch for cues if he starts fires or whatever uh here he needs to get the timing right and i don't know i think the ai will unfortunately where this will, one will break our shield and the beam will hit us. If we had two bars of shield, we would be immune to this guy. In fact, we could pay to get two bars of shield really soon, upgrade-wise. But I like to float some money so when you hit a store, you can buy good things. Alright, they did cooperate and they offlined our shields. That sucks. The good news is we offlined his weapons, so we're fine. If we hadn't, we could be in some tight shit because now that this is down, it just does more damage. Okay. So you notice that we're not using missiles more than we need to. It's a crucial thing to just not waste them. Alright. Sensors are out. We'll have no... Okay. They have a crew teleporter on the first, which means they can try to board us, which is bad. We don't want that is load out. The good news is the heavy nature of this laser doesn't matter. Like, because it's just going to hit our shield no matter what. But it still is a laser and will let his beam through. The bad news is beams hurt. The good news is this isn't any more dangerous here than a one-shot pea shooter laser would be. It's bad because it's killing our shield. That's not going to do anything major. Because this one beam is going to go off regardless, I think. Okay, so they boarded us. We don't have sensors. We need to figure out where. And they're probably going to be mantises, which will suck. Oh, but anyway, the point is we're going to do the thing where we fire the first laser and only Artemis if we don't offline one or the other. So now we need to try to find out where the intruders are. Oh, we didn't heal around there. I'm an idiot. So we wait to see. Okay. We're somewhere around here. Let's get these two. So they're hurting our door control. You can see it's being sabotaged. So we don't even have sensors, but we still know they're in here. Okay, it's a mantis, but it's only one, so... This. We just have to run him away to power Okay, we're good. We can just go for shields now. Friendly, take like one more hit. Stannis was always the fighting brother anyway. Grab one from engines to heal him. I think Stannis is breath. It's got me. It's worth noting crew teleporters can bring them back so we don't get experience, which sucks. But he's got me. If we wanted to, uh, we could try to kill him to see if he doesn't reboard us by Artemising his uh, <laughs> med bay. In practice, this thing takes so long to charge, it's not really a danger. It's just kind of a funny note that sometimes that's the right play. Oh wow, we've just we fucked him up completely. You know what? I'm gonna do it. Fuck that guy. I'm gonna kill that mantis. Yeah! We'll also kill everyone else. But gosh, no. Remember when you're done to. So with 86. So to get the shields up, we would upgrade this twice for 50, and we would need at least one bar of reactor power. We could short shift the engines to get the other. So it would cost about all our money. We could upgrade shields. It's just amazing. Oh god, plasma storm sucks. I could search. I'm gonna risk it. But I remember that. That's what I get for not knowing the things. Uh, Renly is dead now. Fucking shadow babies. Alright. <laughs> Let's... I could handle this, but, like, I'm gonna have enough fine control to choose how many jumps I want when I make it over here. And if there's a store, I'd rather be able to have the freedom to meander to the store. Like, I know none of these are the store, and I'm kind of looking for a store now. So I'm gonna hit this farther off one. Just so I've got a bit more speed in case I need it. Uh, I'm not going to surrender to the slavers, I just lost fucking breath. Remember, after we get out of the power storm, we need to repower everything again. Okay, look at him. Bomb! Whatever. Bombs are... We don't! So this guy's kind of a motherfucker. We're going to expend a couple... He's got a Zoltan energy shield, so this first volley is just gonna like kill his energy shield and not hurt him. But we are gonna expend missiles just to kill his energy shield faster. 
because this setup kind of like wrecks our day. Just that and then... Oh, but luckily his heavy appeared to be a little bit faster than his ion, so he did it backwards and got nothing accomplished. That was really lucky. I'm not going to count on that. So the bomb missed. Oh, I'm stupid. A tip I was going to give you was to vent all three of these airlocks at the start. I forgot, and now you see why you're supposed to not forget. Because if you just leave them permanently vented, it makes the fire dangerous. Now I'm going to do it. Okay, just this doesn't hurt us. We're just going to pop his shields down so it'll be easier to kill. Okay. We could get scrap. I'd rather have slave than a scrap. That's usually true. Especially when you just lost one of your three. Okay. People look. We're going to be on shields. People look. Enjoy. So we're going to leave these open forever. Like we should have done all along. Okay. Oh, hey! These assholes again. Maybe they'll give me another slave. Um, this is excellent! It does nothing. It's gonna just trade with our shield all day, and the Artemis doesn't care we have a shield. So, this is just a guy with an Artemis. Which, unfortunately, that's still pretty damaging, because we have no defense drone. If we had a defense drone, we could just lock out this guy. We don't, so we're still going to expend an Artemis or two to kill him faster. But it's worth just only that... Oh, shit, a breach. Uh-oh. This could be bad. Okay, we're going to use this burst laser to finish off the Zoltan shield, and then laser, because we can't handle all of those fucking Artemises. As I missed. Holy shit. Just wait for the burst laser to clean out the rest of the Zoltan shield. I just gotta hope you can repair everything in time. I technically, you'll notice that like when I offlined, it offlined his missile over his laser, so I could have left it at that. But this way, it'll take longer to repair, so I can't regret it. Please repair this auction before you die, Stannis. It's not gonna happen. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Okay, well, can I accept their offer? Now we just, we could still die here if we don't get auction repaired before, but he's got a big health bar and then Stannis is going to heal him up. And Thomas. Mantises are bad at repairing, but it'll get there faster than we which is what we need for. Okay. Run to Med Bay. Stannis. Actually, no. I want the rock to get good at repairing. Oh, never mind. There's not. It was just the breached room. The other rooms still have enough oxygen. It's not actively joking. We're gonna put Thomas on engines, but it's really uncommitted. What do we really want him for is if we get a crew teleporter. We're just gonna put him on engines because it's an unmanned system. Actually, people look didn't end up getting any. Like he got one shield experience. We could choose to switch him. Um, I think I prefer people look on shields though. A fire and shields just a little more dangerous. Because then, like, we have shields done and they can keep hurting us more. Our health kind of took a beating, but that's not as big of a deal. There are events and stuff that are healers, so I don't even care so much about it. It's this I really hate losing. But, like, I'll pay to, like, try to get to here. I don't like to heal more than this hull that often. Just because if I find an event that gives you a cheap repair or a free repair, I want to exploit it. Okay. It's just one, two, three, four. Yeah, I'll just kind of run this circle looking for a shop. Okay, so the rebels. Hiring the mercenary to deploy the rebels. Wow. He's got the same laser we do that fires three shots and a beam. That's bad. We're gonna overfrag him. Ooh, he's gonna get one bad ball there. Oh no! Oh, Artemis speed. Oh my god, that was amazing. 
Nebula Systems. Ship. 
luckily, there's only three of them. So, our crew is gonna wreck him. In the meantime, it's worth noting, them. he's only got this one laser, so if we stop this combat drone, we're immune to the laser. So we're gonna shoot the combat drone down while we board... Try to sabotage his medical, because then he can't heal back up. Fight him. Of course, the problem with trying to sabotage the medical is then they can heal while they're fighting you, so... Okay. Combat drones offline. Now their weapons don't hurt us. Oh, is that there's like this time for when you can send people back? Okay, yeah, it looks like this plan isn't gonna quite work out. Like the healing they're getting because we're fighting them in there. It's just too much, so let's return. Worth noting that we would have had to like run our dudes away if this fight had lasted any longer. Or if this cooldown had been any longer. But just remember the teleport is a cooldown, and we can't... We're gonna have to cut our auction for a little bit, but you can do that for brief periods as long as you remember to put it back. Because, um... Like, once you use this, then the power's locked into it, so you don't become an abusive once you Oh, I'm stupid, I've been forgetting to fire out. Dead. Let's put these two back. I'm kind of trying to take their ship alive, but since they got a med bay, I don't think it's going to work out. I think I might just kind of keep on shooting them. Mm. Let's give it a go. Only two of them can fight us in this room. And R2, like, this guy's 150 health and he's got double combat expertise. So. And if I... I wonder if I... Fire the Artemis. Can, if there's only one of him, can we stop him from... Because they don't have a pilot, so they can't fly away. That's worth noting, that when the enemy does the thing where it says they're trying to escape, if they don't have their pilot, they can't escape. Okay, we found a prisoner who wants to join our crew. That's excellent. So now we have a prisoner. There you go, and that's boarding. It's pretty fun. So now we're going to put him on engines, and we're going to have both of these guys as dedicated uh, levers. We could also, because NGs repair well, so we could have him as like a dedicated repairman, and like leave people look as the usual engines guy. I do often do that. In this case, though, we've got an NG like on shields, too. So we're just going to have two NGs, either of them who can be the repairman if their half of the ship needs any help. We could almost risk depressurizing this too to minimize fire and just have two separate wings of the ship but these two need to get to med bay often while weekends so we're not going to do that but it's an option there's a store that's really good we like stores um and it is that straight shot we need we don't really have any money for anything but like i said we can't futz around here to get more money for the store we're just beelining to try to hit these nebulae before it's too late so we get more systems for our bunk. Ah, oh, automated reload is kind of good. Only three off, but we can't sell. You can't be a slave or you can't sell your crew. We need both of our weapons. There's really nothing worth buying for us here. We're pretty good on fuel and missiles. Don't need another fucking guy. And, uh, let's just <gasps> buy, a, buy, a, buy a bar of power. We're going to need it at some point. Now this means uh, we don't need to short change this. If we need to run medic, we can still have engines on half capacity, which is important. Away. Okay. These weapons are pretty grody. They've earned an overkill. 
while. These two. Let's kill that pilot. We won't kill them, but like, this way we can shoot down their weapons. They don't have many people free to repair them. They've got the med bay, which sucks, but. We can try to kill them by fragging them. Because the beam now, until they repair this, we're immune to this beam. It's not going to break our bar shield. They got nothing to get through our bar shield, so. We can just try to offline our mech right now. We did. Uh, we're kind of injured, but so are they, and we're great, so. Let's just gather in this room so that we can catch up with the rock man. Sometimes I like to try to micro the rock out in this scenario so that the mantis gets more experience. In fact, let's do it. He's weak, but so are they suck. We got a firebomb, we can sell it for money now. Or use it. Uh, in this case, firebomb is really good with the sensor upgrade. Because you just try to like light fires on the enemy ship. But we have um, borders, which kind of do the same benefits. We may or may not sell this. If we want to use it, we just depower, like, the burst laser and turn it on and see what happens. So there you go, that's a good example of how just nice successful boarding gets you a little more money than the other. Like, obviously not every boarding is the same as every kill, but, like, they're just loot tables. And this just gives you, like, you know, a better loot table. Okay, let him haul this slow rock ass over there. So what we're going to try to do then is go to these nebulae as quick as we can and then up here and then maybe even double back to the store uh yeah oh my god one mantis and one ng and they don't have a med bay and this mantis is going to try to board us what a stupid motherfucker. Let's kill them. Oh, their weapons. Let's stop line them with this. Just the beam hits us once this kills our shield. You see, a second bar shield helps so much, but we invested in the screw teleport, which I don't regret that. That's not good. But, uh, okay, Thomas, we need to go heal. Actually, we can cut it from there, because we're going to teleport to Thomas. He's ready. He's fast. We're not gonna fight them anymore, we're just gonna let him heal. Fortunately, the NGs repair faster, but that's fine, because we're just gonna kill that NG. And the NGs also have, like, less health, so we're gonna kill him, hopefully, even before he can fire his weapon again. But just to be safe, this won't destroy their ship, so let's do it. Yay! Got a little burned out. Let's check experience. Robert is 10 to 15. Stannis is 465. Thomas is already almost a gold level border, which is nice. The pocket people look just the one kill. I suppose I should have microed him out of the engine like I was saying earlier, but I'm hoping these guys will just both hit master rank borders. I'm strongly considering getting the second bar shield soon. Let's hit this distress beacon for now. Oh, I should have let my guy didn't quite finish walking, did he? Oh, sweet. Blew up! Almost out. Almost out. Okay. Alright, we got 30 scrap for that. And you know what? That takes it over the edge for me. Boom. We just like one more bar of power so we can run two bars and the crew teleporter or one one in the med bay. But two bars of shield. This will let us fight a lot more like slowly than we need to otherwise. I think now we can handle doing this, all four of these, this, this. Or no, because I might want to double back to the store, so I'm gonna do this this one now. It's hard to judge. Oh god. An enemy's fighting us in this plasma storm. Okay. Well, the good news is we can't board this guy. 
he's a robot. Like, these are chambers are all 0% oxygen, so there's no point. No crew. So you can't kill it by... So we're gonna run... I'm glad we just upgraded our reactor now. We're at half power. Yeah, we're just gonna try to burst laser down. To just kill off his Artemis. We have a bar shield to negate this. Why does he have two bars of shield? I'm gonna Artemis that shield down. For now, we may as well. Because we don't need shields till this weapon comes back up, right? And so we just need more en do engine because it's more dodge chance. So let's Artemis that and see if we can pull up some of his fucking shields. Back to the burst laser. I'd rather have Kalpaka trained to do this. Please step aside, you two. See, without a defense drone, we've just been taking damage left and right here. This is a scenario when a defense drone is really useful. And they're just fragging you down like this. We would have saved a lot of hull if we had chosen drone, but then we would have also lost it on the scrap that we got from one of these successful boardings. Let's give and take. No! Damn it. This is gonna beat out his Artemis. It's a close thing. Nope. See, so that was an example of like the weak auto repairing that these auto assaults have. Our hull is not that happy. It's a problem. But uh, I believe. I am a believer. Believeies have I. Alright. Here's a little. of shield to charge up. Whereas the weapons will start charging to give them power. So we're going to offline oxygen to get both of these bubbles of shield up. And then that way when we get into the system, we're just going to turn on the weapons and oxygen and those will start going immediately. So it's better than like shield as the... Do I think I can do this, these three, and still like here? No, since I need to double back too, I'm going to not fuck around. I want to be cautious and just do more things. I think I could have done that one. I'm just so bad at estimating that kind of stuff. This means I can double back for the store, though, which is good, because I might want to buy some more repairs now. It's a Zoltan monolith. Okay. I'm going to receive my just dessert. I'm feeling it. Yeah, I got some scrap. Thanks, monolith. back to the store because we've got the 68 and a firebomb we're not really using here we go see this is like a we won't Yeah, no, I timed it about right, it looks like. Excellent. There we go, another burst laser. Only a burst laser one. Still another burst laser. We can't afford drone controller, I would. I saw this firebomb. Only five off, though. That hurts. I would get drone control over this burst laser if I had the money, but I don't. Let's do that. And let's just be safe here. 
So now our next goal is to get like this and more reactor power. Maybe a door upgrade just because doors are good to have upgraded. <laughs> it's just a random thing. That's nice. So if we were meeting him not at the end, we would have... He's not even that bad. These need to hit two of three for the beam to hurt us. Is he gonna please fucking yes? Sure. You know what? I'm just gonna leave him here and count these two. Okay, we gotta make sure to micro because we definitely don't want Akka. Like I said, it's not actually that big of a deal if people could get some over Thomas. We definitely don't want this guy getting one of our precious sporting experiences. Oh, he came back. Oh, they got no med base. I don't give a shit. I'm not even gonna heal Thomas. He's relatively unscathed. He repaired that. Oh, it looks like we got the kill as he was leaving anyway, so... Thomas is gonna go That's enough healing for you. Oh, I should have taken the shot. I had his weapon, so I was just too preoccupied. Whatever. He got one damage in on me. I'll survive. Oh no. Stannis, get out. You know, have a good experience. And start healing. A lot of dudes are just a little dinged up, and we're gonna go take care of them. Mantis controlled sector. Zoltan home. Well, controlled. How much is a door upgrade? We actually. Yeah. Automatically force their way through our doors. They have to like stall a bit. And I'll get time for Thomas and Peeplux to get over there. He already does 10% more damage, so he already beats out a Mantis one-on-one. -on -one. And he's got 150 dude on his side. Oh my god! It's distressed over here. Um, let's choose this one. Because we could go like... Bop. Actually, if we choose this one, we could go... Dot, 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 if we can beat the Rebels out, which is unlikely, I suppose, but... Yeah, whatever. Let's just go. Let's just go. <sighs> Rock crew. There was a fire, and he's... Oh, augmented long-range scanners. What do long-range scanners do? We check our equipment tab. So, you get additional info about nearby... So we'll know there's a ship here. This will warn us about plasma storms, which is good, because fuck plasma storms. So I'm very happy about this. Let's save our money, let's hit these two in the store, and then upgrade to use this burst laser if we don't find anything we like doing these two ships. Or like, with the money we get from these two ships when we hit the store. It's the Mantis. His enemies have bitter, like they're starting to get upgraded. Bigger missile, and he's got this bigger laser. But that's fine. We're just gonna not try to get through shields right now. We're gonna just focus on Artemising him. We're just gonna send in our dudes. They've got no crew teleporter themselves. They've got the, um... We got a med bay, which does suck, but that means we're kind of just gonna get the rain of their ship while we do this. So. Yeah. Yes, I beat that giant fucking shit missile. Just kidding. See now, when we're set hurting them like this, we're not gonna be able to like get complete victory or anything. But what we're gonna do? Shit on this. Ah, I, got, I got all this time on. I'm gonna use another Artemis. What this will let us do, though, is stop them from repairing this here. 
Actually, too, I might be able to kill the NG with this before this. Okay, and let's just run back into here. And I think we can kill them and get their ship reward. Yeah, no one. That doesn't do anything to us, it's just this missile that scares me. That's fun. That's why I want to do Mantis. Pretty good at fighting. Yeah, I want to get the upgrade for this, but let's wait just once more. Oh, I'm not going to that sun. Fuck that sun. I'm just going to hit this. If the rebels still have no map presence, we can even hit this distress beacon too. Oh, we're not going to do it till we heal these guys though. Edmund died. Oh man. Might almost be worth getting an upgraded med bay, just because of all the fighting I'm doing. Like, the he heals you faster. Uh, but all of this, every upgrade idea waits until we see what the store has. If the store has nothing good, our probably our next thing is some reactor power and the weapons, so we can run a squall of five lasers at once. Because that's really good. <laughs> it's almost certainly what we're doing, but I like if there's another burst laser two for sale, I'd rather get that first and then just start setting up these ship upgrades. Two bars of shield is annoying, but we're gonna fight. It. Oh god, this. Is... Oh god. Oh god, Charlie. All right, <laughs> this is gonna be interesting. We're gonna not board, but we've got upgraded doors. We're gonna use people looking Thomas as like a defense. So we're gonna actually move them to the center of the ship. Not board our enemies. Just focus on Artemising the shields and then firing on the weapons. So we're actually gonna wait on the Artemis till the burst laser is charged. Then Artemis the shields. Okay. Going to door control. Let's set up right outside door control. Wait for people look, just don't give enough time to sabotage. But it takes them longer to sabotage because it's got more health. There we go. Let's stop them now. Whoop. Okay. First, this will be charged by the time this lands. So we shoot the shields, and then hopefully it gets rid of at least one bar of shields, so that it's more likely. Hey, it worked! And our two bars of shield protected us. This is when I start pushing. I'd upgraded my med bay, like I was saying. Well, I don't wish. Like I, I gave reasons why I didn't. Like good reasons. Not waste nothing. We can help it. Just Get door control. No. Stop you. You repair it. We're gonna fucking heal. Oh, I should have shot. That's one flaw of mine. I keep getting too distracted with this kind of stuff. Yay, it's on fire. I keep getting distracted with like, my ship and then I like... It, it may seem like auto-fire would make that a better... I, like. It makes auto fire a good idea, but the problem with auto fire, like I'm willing to accept, sometimes I get distracted and don't use my guns rather than auto fire, which can just mess you up. Uh, here we could try to kill. They got no med bay and they're weak, but since their ship's on fire, if the ship gets blown up while we're on it, we're just gonna die. So I'd rather just kill them. Actually, we can just sit and let them die, and we're gonna. It'll be funny. I'm just gonna move everyone back to their posts for later. They're all so weak that they can't put out the fire or they would just die from the damage of the fire. So they're going to die when their crew teleporter gets lit up. Is there no airlock on that whole ship? Okay. So we saved them and gave us a small bomb that I'm going to probably sell. But now we're really rolling in the scrap. Yep, this is no dangerous now, so we're gonna hit this store. And now, we've been taking some hits, but we're about to get really mighty. And hopefully make it through here. Oh, yes. This is good and this is good, but we're just gonna get the vanilla drone control for now. And probably not even use it yet, but just we wanna have it. And then, uh, here, go ahead and take this small bomb, buddy. <gasps> and we got the defense drone, he's my favorite. So now if we're against... 
even without upgrading reactor power, we could just kill a bar of shields to turn on this drone. Uh, it costs a drone part each time, but whatever. We got fucking nine, and we never even bought any. Now we're gonna upgrade that, and that. And now, this. This is what we do. This is our default loadout. Look at So these double shield guys aren't as much of a problem as they used to be. We don't need missiles now. I want to fight this ship, but we have to get here anyway, and this is getting really close. And I'd rather have the freedom to double back. Let's destroy it again, so we're gonna just go here. Okay, what you got for me? Space. A boarding drone, because I helped out an NG. Breaches through the enemy hull and, hull and wrecks havoc. It's cool. Since I've got such accomplished borders, though, I think I'm gonna sell that for cr scrap the next time I get. Like, it's still usable when you've got borders. But there are few enough situations where borders are bad and the boarding drone is good that I'd rather sell it for money and have more money. Oh, we're gonna ignore the sun and this asteroid field. So we're gonna hit this distress beacon and then go, like, thread that needle, kinda. Whoop. Let's do this. We actually need to get fuel at some point here. Oh, except we got lucky! But, I'll exploit this blue option while it lasts. Oh, they were upset because my boarding drone had too much gusto. He just cares about what he does. He's a professional. There's no ships, but I see the ships are in places I don't want to be. So. Oh, I need fuel. Okay, dude. Yeah, I bet you guys wish there was any oxygen in that room, huh? Oh god damn it, I was too slow on my micro, he got a kill experience. Let's just waste it on him. Whatever. Okay. Well, sometimes you're too slow and then your fucking engine guy gets kill experience. It happens. Notice how they had to force that's why I got the door upgrade and went to Mantis Town. Notice I had to force that door open, and then I like won the fight because we split the one and killed him and then Yeah, it's cool stuff. Shame on me. Too slow in my micro. I do have things to sell, but not a lot. And I am like, every jump is precious here. Oh, I do want the fuel, though. I could hit the store for fuel and get, like, not much else. Except for selling the boarding drone. And then, like, hit that, that, and that. Or I could... Yeah, this way is, like... It's just the more conservative. I'd just rather not run out of fuel like a chump, so. System repair, he heals damage subsystems, not super great. Eh, take that. And give me all that. And, um, eight drone parts is sufficient. And I'm gonna just pump up to that and save this money for shenanigans. Maybe even upgrade the med bay like I keep saying I will. 1.5 speed. For now, I'm just gonna float this though, in case there's a nice job around with you. We're gonna do this because I want to fight a ship, and then we're gonna leave. Sure. We haven't fought since we got the burst lasers, we wanna test them out. So it's an AI, so now. So he's trying to escape, which is normally this big problem, because it makes the rebel feet faster. Alright, we're gonna actually, we're gonna stop him from escaping. He kinda hurts us with this laser barrage, but. No, we're gonna just we're gonna take the conservative answer. So what we do is we wait for burst lasers to both be charged. Notice that this one is slightly and we fire them at once, because then these two bars of shield mean a lot less. Yeah, we're gonna let him escape if he can escape. I'd rather ensure I don't get hurt. Okay, and now Now I can just go for his engines. Cause he needs all three of his shots to connect to do one damage to us. That's a lot better for us, so. Now we're going to go ahead and go for either his pilot or his engine. Probably his pilot will have less health, it just generally does. Or no, autopilot means it might be his engines. Plus a partial success on the engine matters and a partial success on pilot doesn't. So yeah, let's go for those when both charged. 
God. Oh, please repair that so we can breathe. Or, no, I need to keep remembering not to line them up like that. There we go. Right, he can't get out. Oh, he keeps getting successes. I'll go help Stannis so he doesn't take fucking forever, please. I may as well fire this once, even though it needs all three to hit. I need to be lucky. Just because, like, when I turn this on, it will take a full charging anyway. You know, I'd save, like, half a second by not doing it this way. So let's see, whatever. Hey, I got lucky. Hooray for luck. Yeah, you still can't escape, so now we'll just do this so even lucky hits don't kill us. Yay! We took more damage than what I liked, but we're okay. Defense wouldn't help because he did not have any missiles. Now we run. Run forever. God damn it! Please. You've only got one bar of shield. I don't give a fuck. So he's got... Okay, this is a... Because if we turn on this defense drone, these lasers take one with almost immune to his missile. Very rare. To bay. We're gonna board him and kill him. And we're gonna be invincible in the meantime. So we can just turn off to get the power. Not even just yeah. We'll just turn off the lasers. Hardly even shoot them. at all. Kill him. So we fired all three at once. Those two missed. Oh, but so this, so this orbits you and they hit. So by bad luck, <laughs> the fence drone was just wasted here. Whatever. We took one hit that we could have. Okay, we need to be careful to not lose Thomas. Nobody's going for people because he's dumb, so we're fine. Yay! And there we go. It wasn't Earthus that saved us from that one missile. You know what? Let's go ahead and do that now. Speed up. There are some blue options with the improved med bay, and just I'm feeling it now. It'll I'll be less bored right now too. Robert. Probably want other bar reactor power, but I'm gonna save that for now. Mantis Homeworlds. Maybe I'll get the final upgrade of doors. But I'd like to float some money for shops. But this is good money. Ooh, and then the shop right here. Let's do this, this, and then hit the store. I like it. I like it. Two ships and then the store. Buy some repairs. Okay. I think this beam has a little bit of cleave to it. But we'll be okay mostly because he's only gonna like knock out a bit, and uh, we're gonna try to zerg him down. Uh, the drones won't help us, so let's just get right on here. And uh, he's got no med bay, so let's just fight in his here. Oh my God, they boarded us! What the fuck? Why would they do such a thing? Okay, well this is kind of weird. All for as long as you can, buddy. About to be ready to fire. Okay. Well, that's their ship taken care of. They did light our oxygen, though. It happens. Come on, please. We're injured, but they suck. 
so we should be alright. Careful, he's actually a master level fighter, so now we need to try to micro him out of fights to let his buddy get the experience. I actually know what I'm gonna do now. Or no, I'm gonna wait for the shop, but I'm probably gonna upgrade my crew teleporter just to make its cooldown a bit faster so I have less of a chance of losing my release weak guess. But it all depends what the shop has. Mantis, he's not happy. Here we go. One scary and a missile. Uh, he's got a med bay. This is a really interesting fight. There's a lot of ways we could choose to take this. I think what I'm going to do, cut that, grab a defense drone. I do need to... I think, yeah, I'm going to try holding in status mostly and just counting on lucky shots. So I have enough power for that. I need to get power. Probably even like before I hit the shop. It's just important to have power. And we're gonna go... Fight him. Count on lucky shots. He does have a med beta run too, but it means... Oh, fuck! What I should have done, and I'll do after this, is use the Artemis and just try to kill the guy here. I offlined it. I don't even need the Artemis now. Defense drone, you're a bro. Oh. Run, Thomas, run. Oh shit, they offlined my drone, and so now they just fucked us up really bad. Um, but we looted a lot from them, so we're kind of okay anyway. Fire, get ready to help out. Oh, I think we're good. Good. Yep, okay. Everything is fine. Okay, we're in a bad shape, but not as bad as we look, because we're fucking rich. And we can use this to get mighty. We probably need a little bit more reactor power to juggle all our balls at once or something. But we won't get it now, because now we will be able to hit store next. So we're just going to finally get this, like we've been saying we will. And see what our vast fortune will get us. Some more crew members, but we're pretty good on those. A fire beam. A beam that lights them on fire. <sighs> the idea is really entertaining. A beam that lights them on fire. But, uh, borders. And we have them already. And, uh, yeah, I'd rather save this money. We're gonna just pop up to, like, this zone. And then we're just gonna upgrade our ship power for sure, like I said. This could be worth it, because we're in Mantis territory. Hmm. 
could just try to get my third bar of shield. And we won't. I'm convinced this is a good idea. We would like a little bit more reactor power, but we got... Oh, and let me get... Just... Okay, we're broke, but I'm pretty happy with what our ship is looking like right now. We're gonna pry open this pod. There's a mantis who decided to join our crew. Sure, man. You'll be our backup fighter. For when he can defend from border. We'll put him in the middle then. He'll defend from borders while these two go out ranging. Or if we think it's safer, we can leave Thomas to try to not get more experience. Ah, oh, that would turn him dying so much. Should have brought water. Don't want to go fight near suns. Let's go fight near whatever this is. This hail is merely a destruction. Okay. Scary. So we're gonna power down our on our defense drone. And, uh, fuck them up. They got no med bay, so we'll just. Take them and draw. Take them in waves. Let's uh, let's wait a minute. See where the end. Oh, they're gonna board us first. Adorable. This will make things even easier. They're gonna board us and come to that room with no oxygen. Wait for them to slowly beat their way there as they suffocate. They all missed. I don't really give a shit, though. We need to be careful that we move Thomas fast enough. And him. So where are these kids going to run off to? Then? Kill him. Oh, except I'm supposed to micro Thomas to not. I really should have brought the trainee in this year, actually. Remember, the ship combat barely matters at this point. Uh, we gotta just... Oh, I see we got the food door, so when I try to move, he has to fight them open just like I do. See, that defense drone is saving our ass. Alright, we're both going here. Oh, let's just... That works too. Come back, my children. I probably shouldn't have done that. I probably should have given the experience away, but... We all make mistakes. Yeah, I need to seriously start considering letting Narth go on rangings too, like... Decide whether I send him or Thomas. Check. Robert is a green level pilot. He's asking green level weapons. These guys are both good fighters. Aki is getting there. Kalpaka, he hasn't really done much, but he's repaired a lot. Alright. That one guy, yeah, Kalpaka is still a bit injured. Go heal up. Oh, another store. I don't want to do that, though. I spent all my money on fun shit. I don't want to waste a jump on the stores. A mantis ship. Let's kill it. Please, please jump. It would make me feel so good. Bring Aki in just to make sure. Then I gotta make sure to micro him out so our chitlin wins. And then we'll, uh... Oh, I need to turn on. I'm not gonna bother firing the weapons, unless I really need to. Let's just go ahead and finish these guys up. If we do this fast enough, they shouldn't have time to return on the control board. I gotta make sure to micro the right people in both fights here. Okay, Thomas, you move. And Aki, you move. I actually kinda of, kinda of find the kid. 
get there. So, no. But I was correct, so. Actually, we do. Actually, I can just even cut down a second. save it, but I'm strongly considering just more. Well, let me see. If I want to run the shields, I can have... Yeah, I want another power reactor power right now. Just avoid the store. I was thinking I may be able to just hit up the store. Oh my god, what is happening? Combat drone, combat drone. If I shut down the lasers, I'll be able to handle the combat drones. So I think that's my goal. Defense does nothing for me here. So I don't need that. I have too much reaction power then if I don't want defense drones. I should have thought about that. I need to get maybe a fifth bar of weapons and run my Artemis at the same time then. So let's sabotage their weapons, or try to and shoot down their drones. Okay. So that's on fire. Oh shit. Okay, we he got the kill I wanted. Go heal, go heal. I guess my spare power isn't too bad because I can run. Let's get Narth ready for the next ranging. And then let's. This could have been a lot worse than how it ended up. We got no med bay. Pretty safe from them weapon wise. Yeah, you too. Why don't you go and finish this off for me? Yeah, weapons. I don't think I'm gonna need them though. Get on this pad. Rock. Hull beam. I want to look this up, but first let's get them going there. Hull beam. Beam weapons. You like draw a line, and you do damage, and it's really good. and run these in the hull beam as my loadout. Seems pretty sensible to me. Avoid the shop now and just farm up money. Yes, sir. Pull the hull beam. Do I want to try to buy something strong at the shop by selling the hull beam, potentially? Or do I want to just, um, avoid it and just get money to run the lasers in the hull beam? Hull beam's like my least favorite because it damages their health, but it doesn't do any good against subsystems. So I think I'm gonna play roulette and see what happens. And then I'm gonna have to fucking haul you to ass from these rebels, just like here, here, leave. Burst laser, burst laser. Yeah. <gasps> There's defense too. Fires faster and gets you down incoming lasers, but it takes four. This is good. So I'm gonna blow up our down lasers is a cool thing.
try to... Leaving you north. Yeah, we're good. Good. Okay, we're gonna heal and then board with these guys. Um. Oh shit! I thought he was dead, but he wasn't. Now Stannis has a random two. How did Stannis get two? I mean, we can cut a bar of shield because he's only got the one laser and we're defense drones. You guys, I hope I'm stressing how crucial defense drones are. Cloaking can kind of help because you can make missiles auto miss. Yeah, stand aside, Thomas. We, we have you for when shit's more dire. I'm just gonna try to train the newbies. Although here we train Stannis because I don't even fucking. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh uh, god! That's not. No, no, no. I don't even want to cap right now. Just, just, this is your guys' fucking duty now. So we don't die to the missiles a lot. Anyway, let's go. in time. Did I get it in time and it's going to save us from this missile that's firing right now? <laughs> yes! Uh, both North and the guy can stand again more. I don't need to find out which one. This guy's not going for North, it's going for it. Oh. Goodness. I'll be an upgrade upgrading drone control. kind of a hard stage to choose what we want now. Uh, there are many options that are useful. Um, we could grab the fifth weapon power. So There'll be some guys where we just need to frag them and not board them. So I'm gonna just jump on this fucking bullet now. And I can like... Yeah. I handle this much and then I distress yeah cuz this will get me to that. make it this and then the other distress so I may as well at least try it for sure okay mantis bad laser and a bomb defense drone won't help me defense 2 would help me cuz it shoots on lasers but I don't have the ability yet so let's um Fire a full volley at their weapons, see who they send to kill them, and then. So these guys make sure I micro Thomas out of experience. Well, I might not be able to just because it's not the game too early. Um, actually, let's uh, Artemis their teleporter, see if we can stop. Them. I have to go heal. Cut engines so they're healing at better speed. Yeah, I'm, I'm okay with the upgrade choice that I made there. 
Okay, now it's just the bomb. What the fuck ever. We'll wait for wait for these to time together and kill their teleporter. My upgraded sensors mean yeah, I now lost their ship, but I haven't lost. Okay, why don't you kids go in now before I take the one hull damage from the subsystem? Oh shit, when did they get their weapons back up? I wasn't paying attention. No. No! This is very on bueno. I only took one damage, so I was lucky. They should have taken way more for how bad that was. But I did that. Now. Now I may as well finish them off. There's no fires, so I'm not risking my guys bringing them on their ship. So I should just finish them off. Borders. Right. How are the experience? So people look, he's getting there, and North is almost at that level. Right. I might just want to beeline for defense for. Grab like... Yeah, I can get there now. And then next I'm gonna... Alright, let's put everyone back where they belong. On this north, you are on call for teleporter, but also there's a defensive kind of guy. Okay. I'm just checking everyone's health for a minute. I could just use this, but... When it's marginal, I like to just hover. Alright, let's do this. Yep, I can just barely pull this off. Still hit the exit. Which is nice. Stress. They want fuel. I got fuel to burn. And they're gonna give me a Pegasus missile. Two missiles, two damage each, pierces all shields. Kinda cool, I'll probably end up selling it, but I can run Pegasus in a burst laser, so it's an option available to me. Uh oh, the rebels hit the exit. I didn't think they were going to. So now I'm going to have a rebel encounter, which is just like a strong ship, and I get very bad rewards. So. In this case, they said you're just going to survive to the next sister. The reward for killing these guys, not actually that good, believe it or not. And they got a med bay. So I'm just going to uh, cut down weapons and stuff. We're just gonna chill here and wait till we can leave. <laughs> sure, buddy. This burst laser won't even hurt them. It's pointless. Maybe, like, I wouldn't even leave it on because I've got nothing else to leave on. What the fuck? What kind of fucking defense drone are you, buddy? Okay, Kalpaka, you need to leave. Uh, Thomas, you need to leave too. Seriously? Did you see that drone? He's just like, eh, I could stop it. Whoa. Oh, a missile's gonna hit me. No reason. They're faster idiots. Oh, I should look not there. Mantises are bad at repairing, but even so. Okay. There we go. Thank you. I actually fired it. Oh, the oxygen just temporarily cleared here because they forced it open. Oh, I think this is broken. Thank you. That defense from 2 is useful. Okay, Aki, just go heal. Alright, leave. You can heal, but now's not the time. So we're just trying to leave as fast as we can. Christ's sakes. That's why you're supposed to... Now you see I've been trying to outrun the rebels, now you know why. He just shot a laser out of midair, I like him for that. I'm glad you can do that, buddy. Okay, we're almost ready to leave. We'll heal Robert. We can't heal him now, we won't be able to leave, so we'll heal him just next safe chance we get.
But that's fine. It's more exciting, I imagine, to watch a close one. Okay, Kilpaka was engines. These are my main men. Oh, did I accidentally move wherever? So confused. Stannis, you wait here, Kilpaka. Alright. There's a door here. Enemies everywhere. Let's hit the distress in the middle on the side of the front door. Alright, but I should first stuff more like the arrangement. Yep, and then I can turn on defense drones as needed. I might need to start buying drone parts, but we'll see. I might just get that up. This guy wants help. Okay, he'll give us a down payment, and he wants us to lead him to his quest. Sure, we'll go, like, here, and then go to the quest, and then just fuck around in this area until we're out of time. Now we can already afford it. Even with this and this, it's not enough for the beam to get through. I think we're immune to these guys. I could be wrong. Maybe if they all hit exactly at the right time. But even then, we've got dodge chance to contend with and stuff. I think we're totally safe. And I think that means we're gonna go and do some ranging, especially because they got no uh, end day. So why don't we even? They've got only humans on board. Why don't we send? Yeah, if I just laser their, uh, weapons, I'm sure to be fine. We'll go kill the engines guy and just shut them later. Oh, that's why they're dangerous. They're in a boarding room. Well, oh, glad we saved Thomas thing. Stannis, you've got random experience for no reason. No bug, too. I want to kill their drone control over their weapons. Also stop these fucking drones. Johnny misses. I got a lot of this, sure. Yay! You know what, let's this time, let's Artemis through shields, and then after this lands, we'll do this. Okay. Gotta do this really carefully so it works out. Stand and smith at first and let him kill. We, we already accounted on venting that area, like we've already been venting it, so. Oh wait, I'm stupid, I should have another. I thought this was Narth, but it was Thomas, so I microed that backwards. I should have let Stannis. As useless as, it, useless as it is for Stannis to have experience, it's like better than the guy who's full. Oh, for Christ's sakes. Okay, we'll wait for these two. I think this will. No, I need to run. I think this will offline their drone, but I'm not sure. Yep. And now we just need to fix that breach before we run out of oxygen. Oh damn it! He still feels like he has to fight at first. Okay. Thomas get on call. Because of the way this works, I want to just all at once. Alright, okay, Thomas, start. Get the other NG for the breach. Ready to go. Alright, fight it too. Afterwards, I want them to both repair the inside breach. Look, 
Like, well, I don't really care, because, like, I've been permaventing that anyway. I still may as well now fix this breach up just so it's not there. Oh, safe. Okay, Aki goes here. Baka goes there. Bebok. Thomas. Arf. Okay. Bebok's almost full up, too. I got good borders. I got <laughs> not too much haul. So I can now, by going, I can run all five and that and the defense drone by not. I'm not going to upgrade power anymore. I have to make some difficult decisions, but I find the optimum is to have to make some difficult decisions rather than have enough power to run absolutely everything great at once because then I'm kind of floating this extra money. I might need a shop, buy some hall upgrades, etc. Okay. No doubt. My defense won't help, only defense two will help. And as good as it is to shoot their lasers out, I think I'd rather risk it once. They got no med bay. I just gotta zerg down their weapons once. And then I, um... Yeah, I zerg down their weapons once, and then I have them, and I just bore them. I just gotta kill one or the other, and I'm pretty good. Or no, I need to kill the laser no matter what, actually. Oh, nice. Go ahead and send Narth instead. And we will take out... Just this random fucking guy. Yeah, I should probably get at least level 2 of that. There. Wait for it to land. So, yep, I did kill one bar shield, which is what I wanted. There we go, I'll find their big laser. Now we're good. Let's go assemble here. I don't actually want to take out their O2, I just want to be fighting this guy with that one. The weapons are on fire. Just you kids, go ahead. Yeah, we're fine. They're not gonna fix that anytime soon. You see now, boarding the sensors too are so crucial. Imagine what doing what I'm doing here without sensors too. Right. So people, Luke, he's almost to the max. I don't know. That I just have to. Soon my three borders will all be maxed, I'm gonna just start not caring about, like, I don't want to, like, start bringing my main ship as borders, just once they're all at max, then I just won't micro to do experience, it'll just be a little bit easier. But now I'm gonna try to micro him away. Yeah, just let Narth slip. I don't want that heal upgrade, but do I get it now? I think I wait a little bit longer. Not the upgrade, the heal upgrade, or the fuck I have enough heal upgrade. I don't want to get the second tier. What I kind of want is to get a sec, like another level of teleporter, and try to be running it at that. Let's do quest and then store, and then after that we'll buy a ship upgrade. So there's nothing in the store that I want. Oh, sweet! The quest healed me, and it's another store. I want cloaking. I could get it. What are... There's an achievement actually. I haven't got on this to get. Just, and that's just what I'm gonna do. I guess I have to hit this door now anyway, because there's just nothing else for me to go. Hee 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 hee. 
many good things. I think I kind of like having the two options for defense drones, though, so I don't need to pack four power in if I don't need to. And on the other hand, later on, I like I might just buy an anti-ship drone to have in my pocket, because once I'm actually running, I'll want one defense and one non-defense, like when I have like my full optimal ship. So I won't be using this for a while, but I might still get it. Um, I could just get another burst laser one, though. What's the max on this ship? I can have eight bars of ship of weapons power. So I could run all these at once. But I'd rather not. And my reasoning is this. I'd rather not pay for my... ...and a really good fourth, like a... ...be wait. I'm not going to buy a fourth weapon. I think I'm going to buy a drone that will eventually, like, I'll have it as an option, like, once I'm running enough power to run an anti-ship drone and, uh, defense drone. Well, the reason applies for my drone. I could just wait, like, in case I find a good drone. So I might just buy not a couple fuel and some coal and just work on getting my weapons up, I said. I'm going to do that. I just want to fight all these ships. I'm feeling like fighting. Actually, I'm gonna... Yeah. Just do a line up like this. Okay. Tiny missile, a big fucking awful laser. They have a med bay. Matter. Let's so. so North needs two kills and people who needs one. Sick, why am I so bad at micro going? Two get over here. Don't have any idea, I'll block it. Oh, I've got guns. I don't think I need to shoot them actually. Maybe I can just go ahead and. Oh no, here's what I'll do I'll save the Artemis and I'll just do this. Perfect. Wait for them to repair it. Feel much more relaxed in this game gets with defense drones and full shields. Maybe I should have healed. I'm fine now. I just need to have Narc leave soon. Let's go in. Who needs guns? Guns are lame. I always said. Maybe I'll regret not having that drone recovery arm, but I seem to be running a pretty reasonable rate. If I just find drones periodically, I'll be fine. So Narth is maxed, so only pe- Oh no, people have got it. Alright, now it doesn't even matter that I've like, just- I got some random border experience. My main borders are all perfect, so now I'm gonna main keeping people- And have like a- yeah, 20% more damage. I want the second level porter, but the first thing has to be sixth bar of weapon power for burst lasers. Let's do this. I, I have a good like plan for the future that doesn't rely on any stores. Um, it's a scout. I don't really need like 26 scrap is a lot of scrap. There's no reason for me to risk getting dinged up when I don't really need because I've got my auto scout anyway. Like, I don't really need any more information, which is what that gives you. Like, yeah. yay. Call this a default spec. So this is 
three, six, eight shots that I can coordinate all at once. Shame I didn't buy other burst laser, but if I find a two or three, I'll be happy. Yep, I think next is reactor power and teleporter. I'll defend the outpost here. Alright, no point sending missiles on him, but these only level ones, they don't stop mine. Uh, and this, we're completely immune to is with three bars of shield. This gets through one, this gets through another. Um, or no, is this the same pea shooter I have? Yeah, this is the one that does one shot, not two. So one shot, one shot, I ignore it. This beam doesn't get through the last bar shield. These ignore missiles, I don't have any missiles. Um, we just need to stop in case he's got those freaking raging grounds. So we're just going to shoot this now. Or no. He won't have enough for reaching drones. He's running two defense drones. He's off the energy. We're gonna frag his med bay and then just uh, kill him for one. Yep, one one, and the beam doesn't get through. This is gonna be beautiful. Yeah, we just gotta defend that. come into them in bursts and kill their shit. Yeah, no reason, no worry. Yeah, you're getting a little bit low. Oh wait, right, there's no point micro and we'll just... Need to go get some R&R. &R. Oh. Hey! No! fire and then we'll board it once the fire's out. Otherwise I'll put it hurt, I'll be in the fire. I'll be dead. Oh my god, is the fire gonna do it? I don't need the experience, I guess, anymore, so whatever. Someone else wanna have to get border experience. I believe in you! Do it, so we can go murder you. Yay! I don't even need to, it's just more fun. So. Oh man, and the outpost gave us some shit too. Nice. Well, only north is hurt, I think. Definitely, I wanted to that. that that's given. The rest, I think, I'll save in case there's something cool at the store or whatever. But there, now I can have that be a little bit faster. I don't have to risk losing my two awesome max range borders. Oh, also ranks Roberts a master pilot. Stannis is getting close to Master Weapons. People Luke, he, well, he been left, he's been leaving as a border so often. Oh, wait. Why is People Luke on engines? That's this guy's job. How long has he been doing that? I'm fucking dumb. Oh, I bet someone's been watching this video like, what the fuck is this guy? I forgot that when I got this guy, I demoted him from engines. Because I said so many good candidates. So, okay. Whatever. I could actually start getting some engine upgrades, but then again, I kind of ignore missiles anyway with the uh, drones. Do I want... So if I wanted to run all my weapons and the defense, I'd have to cut out border. Is that good? Do I want to... I don't know if I want how I want to do power. I'm just going to ignore it. And just wait for a shop. I want to... I'll do this first. I don't know how I'm going to do the order. Depends what I find when I hit this one. Uh, it's a forward radar station. I could keep my distance, but two lasers and one missile. I'll send a defense one. I'll ignore these. Fuck it. Oh, never mind. These are our second memo. So let's do... Well, there's no point. I, need... I don't need boarding now. So I'll just do that, and I'll do that. Shot. First volley will go to shield, just for next volley's better chances. And you gotta turn up to... <laughs> no. Yeah, I might just start... Oh, I should've not... Should've waited for something. There's only one bar shield, I'll save that maybe. Out. Okay, we'll do one 
first with just the two of these, and then we'll synchronize. I don't need to hack it, because I don't have much farther to go. So, I don't want to like, yeah, I'm going to just buy some drone parts, but that's fine, they're not that expensive. <sighs> I'm just going to save my money for that. see what falls out of the tree here. I could do a lot of these, but I just, like, can't do, like, the exit is so soon. I'll just go. Alright, sure. Cool. Okay. Let's get a defense drone just to be safe, because this laser is a piece of shit. Boarding because this laser is just too deep. First follow, cell phone on the shields, cell phone on the Ah, you just see it charging like a piece of shit. Yep, it's a good thing I had my buddy here. I remember how to do that. Okay, now his big one's down. Pretty safe. Next we'll volley back on his shields and on his weapons. I could probably do better, but this is a drone part, and I want to put this so I'm sure. Make up for my mistake. Oh shit, even this was too slow, really? You know what I'm gonna do now? Uh, I'm gonna... Rise up. Faster FTL. An example being, like, right fucking now, I'm probably just gonna wanna run from the enemies, so... Yeah. So I have that. can handle just my crappier defense drone, uh, but actually what's the point? I'm just gonna turn this off, turn that off, turn that off, and we're just gonna run away from the enemy. <laughs> the rules are so shitty when it's these mandatory ones. Oh, as if, buddy. As the fuck if. Alright, two guys fight at double strength with 1.5 times healing versus whatever the fuck it is you're looking for. No. As a green upgraded mansion, this would have incapacitated us from later. Hooray for foresight. Shot down drone control, that'd been real unfortunate because the drone is what's saving my ass. Sultan. Yep, so now we just have that as a sink for when we're not using that power anywhere else. Yay, a store. I just want to hit this for the ship money and we're gonna hit the store. It's a slug. He's packing a tiny missile, a crappy laser. These don't get through, I can just run my crappy defense drone. 
and they got no med bay, so... I might not even need, I could just risk the one Artemis and just try to bring him down with lasers instead. But I either risk a damn- actually with only four drone parts, I'd rather even risk it this way. What we're gonna do is, uh... Sucks, but the four drum parts you gotta be careful. Actually. Oh, except I could have ended up that next one if I had fired again. So that next, this next two damage I took was just because I'm stupid. And I like, didn't think to fire when I lost sensors. But I can't see them, so there's no point shooting them. Don't up, I'm all take damage like an idiot. At least I'm rich enough when I hit this door, I can just pay for as much damage repair as I dang need. Um, let's move you and make sure Anki hits the experience. How long have I had this mantis chilling here? When did I get this mantis, guys? <laughs> I had him for like ages and just kept forgetting to move him anywhere. I guess I could get him some border experience we'll have. Yeah, so like we'll have these two as our good borders and these two as our crap. Oh, I didn't, this doesn't have a diagonal like I thought it did. I'm gonna have to do some unorthodox shenanigans. I really hope that Rebels don't have the store. I hope I can make it to the store in time. Okay, it's an enemy AI. Don't need any boarding. I got that to play with. What do they got? Oh, this is like fine. One, two, three, take your hand. You can't hurt me. Eat some nuts forever. I think I saw some boys. For free. He does not have a good enough. Yeah, uh, they can each do one point of damage, and so it's just not gonna hurt me. Let's choose the shields first. I think it's the fastest. Oh what? Oh, I guess he can get slightly more than one a shot or something, or the EMP does two shields. Whatever. You got a damage I didn't think you could get. That's it though. Yeah. I want to leave him up because he's. Oh, that's why. Because I depowered this missile that I depowered it. That's why that third shot got through. I was correct in my like knowledge that three was enough, but I wasn't running the third for some reason. So I'm sorry. Repair is kind of cool. You can spend drone parts. Oh, I don't have the roll for the ship. 
Yeah, I can only get up to 8 power, so I can't run. Otherwise, it'd be good to run, like, this big burst of lasers, and then finish up with the heavy laser mark, too. But no. Could just grab this over the Artemis, but... all the way, but now I'm gonna, because I just don't have much to anymore. Okay. Put the other lasers. Start going here to as many nebulas as I'm psyching out. Great. Fine. It's the great eye. I'm gonna get my just dessert again. I lost a crew member. Please be Borman. Yay, Borman! I barely even knew that you were there. And now it doesn't matter that I neglected you. So everyone's a winner except for Borman. Possible ship detected? Sure, let's do it, buddy. One one shot laser and two two for total five. I have three. Worth the drone part? I say yes. I'll shoot once I'm waiting for this fucking eye unlock. I think I'll get lucky. Yeah, it was prudent to use this defense drone too. Reactivate when you've already, like, used. Like, you don't pay another drone part to reactivate it. Okay. This bastard can click again. I'm probably gonna kill you when I'm mad. I'm just gonna kill your fucking clothes. Yay!
Yeah, just the light defense drone's enough for this one. I just want to stop those missiles. The Scion won't do enough to let his beam through. So, crappy defense drone. And maybe boarding him. We'll let the cloak end and find out for sure. Now we'll do this. Oh, right, we're in a nebula, so I don't get to know. And he has a med bay, so I'm not going to bother trying to board when I can't see. I'm just going to shoot him the cloak down. Oh, fucking please, buddy. Please. Nice, nice. Um, how risky am I feeling? Yeah, I'd rather take this kind of sassy shield first and then the weapon first. Okay, you kids. Port to med bay. I'll grab one from the engines to heal you. Not two, because it's not really urgent. Just on the up chance to send orders again. Now that I know that, I'll stop being a fucking twat about it. Just, oh, these ones. But I guess it doesn't actually matter. Does it? <sighs> Only one drone part. I'm gonna see what I get better. I was letting the blue lasers in the air finish. Yeah, better, better result. Excellent. Okay, now I'd really just like to find a store. Try to get something really nice to. Just kind of like an end game thing of gear. Oh shit, what is this? Crappy. Doesn't have enough shots to get through. Just a bomb. Alright, we're gonna go. We need to stop him from alerting of our position, so we're gonna do something a little bit unconventional. And we're gonna do the Artemis right away on the shields. We're gonna risk his first round of bad shit. And we're gonna do our laser bot drop on his engines. Save the Artemis, I'm not gonna go get away. Yeah, we're just. We're doing alright, unless we get one of those unlucky defense drone fails. I'm gonna try to avoid those. Okay, yeah, we're good. I can't get to four, though. Um, do I fight an enemy in an asteroid field? Do I, do I, do I? I'll go here, and I'll kind of make up my mind from that. Oh, sweet! Um, it's rarer than a teleporter, so I'm hoping this will mean a better result. I got 40 home. Um, I could choose to go here or here, and then it's this. Or I could try to... Oh, but this isn't a nebula, so look at a big... This isn't either, so actually I'm going to just be safe and do the three nebulae. And... Alright, I'm saving most money. I'm going to grab one more reactor power now, I'm sure. Oh, fuck ion storms, though. Oh, no. But there's not, like, any enemies there, so what's even up with this? Are they gonna board me and there's an ion storm or something? I think I wanna just find out what this is, even though I hate ion storms with passion. We're just gonna go here and see what happens. Because there's no ship boarded. What is it? Borders? Okay, it's pirates and ammunition. I 6 fuel and 23. Let's secure the fuel supply. Oh, but it's not gonna be pirate. Alright. So I don't want to work this. That is all lasers. That is many lasers. So let's... Yeah, 
don't think I can justify my defense grenade that would be really useful for this guy. Just because I can't, like, you know what I'm saying? Get anything done. I'd have to, like, abandon my shields for it. It's not that much better. Maybe it sounds cool. Oh wait, these are charged on the same time, so I can just auto-fire them. Okay. It's fire. We're happy about fire. We can tell because it like died without us being on it, so. This could have gone bad, but it looks like it's not going to. Looks like it did. Sassy and shoot the engines. I don't know. Why not? Oh, that's right. Remember my tip from last time about ion storms? Get your shields to full, and then when you get there, you can immediately charge your weapons up and have them lag like the shields do. Um, I could shoot a laser down. Actually, I got eight drone parts. This is a laser three. So, not only could I, but I will. It's not the best. Just to be safe. This will shoot five bullets. Like, this shoots five shots. So, I'll be happy to have this kid. Because he's going to get his one volley off guaranteed. Because he's got this cloak to charge up. I'll just so. Fair. He's got no shields, so let's drop the fucking boys. Yep. Now I know to wait for his cloak to go off first. If it's just this alive, I'm shooting for Mantis control their slug home. It's a home nebula. I don't normally like nebulae, but it's a home. I might have something interesting and fun. Is there something I can buy now? That would help me at all? I can get my fourth bar of shield. And I might if I don't find a shop soon. Just... No, let's just fight this room. Let's see what's up. Hopefully he has fuel. Oh. This... I'm immune to all these weapons. My only problem is that they sabotaged my oxygen. So let's invest some of these missiles. Are like first thing, kill him as fast as we possibly can. Throw down an Artemis every time too. Just there's no point for us targeting anything but shield unless it does the thing to run away. Just kill the people who are in there trying to repair them because we just need to speed through this before he suffocates us. I am confident enough that I am going to try to, yeah. Okay. Let the auction repopulate. I think 82 with all our airlocks open. Like, it was not good. 
dead. nothing, then I can sink money into the shields four. So we're good. And it's a slug. Hey, they want a customer. Sure. Dangerous times. Purchases are final. Understood. No customer share. It's not a problem. Wow, he locked down our weapons. What a shithead. Uh, defense one's enough. This we're immune to. There's a border. We gotta find him. I don't see him. I hear... Oh, it's door control. Okay. I was looking for a flashing door. I thought I was trying to break out, but nope, he's just breaking. Oh, it's a slug. Slugs have, like... Yeah, the slugs are not that strong, and we are incredibly strong. Alright, I hate boarding without sensors, but, like, they're just gonna lock all of our weapons, so I guess this is what we're doing. Let's see if we can break this before they get here. We're so good, can we win a fight in their own mid bay? Are we that strong? Like barely not. Oh, this fucking sucks. I think I just have to run away like a coward. Because I can't win the fight in their med bay. If I fight them anywhere else, they'll run to their med bay. And I can't attack their med bay because my weapon's gone. Whatever. I think the whole point of this fight is you're supposed to have to run away. And I almost did. I was just fast enough to. Cloaking and stealth weapons. Drone recovery arms are cool at this point. I'm so close to the end, I think I can just handle. This is tempting too, this is a good item. But... Well, uh, well at any rate, we're definitely gonna get decide if I want like a shield charge booster. I might actually sell my scanners now. They've been really useful but it's near the end of the game and every bit counts. Like the next sector is the final sector so I think I might go ahead and sell. Oh, they're only worth 15 though. Do I get... I might also just let me get my cloak up which I might just do instead. Just like cloak and power now. Yeah, but then I can upgrade cloak. My, my rationale here is I can upgrade cloak just when I leave, but I can't buy this again, so I'm gonna buy this. fight all the dudes here. Let's, okay, let's do this. Oh, I should charge my weapon. Fuck, man. Impose this count. Captain. Sure. Oh, wow. Look at this, like, worthless spec. And just to be safe, I am gonna cloak anyway. Thank you. 
Robert's a master, Stannis is a master. Master, 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 master. Excellent. That's just my name. I don't know. I use expert and master. I don't know. I like they have approved words. Yeah. I like mysteries. Let's do it. That actually wasn't awful. I mean, it wasn't much money-wise, but then if I don't buy the shop again, I'll be grateful. Um, more fighting, sure. Ever fighting? Fights better. Hello, slug pirates. I can ignore these two. I just need anti-missiles. Um. Yeah, I like this suspension. Just let me fire all these and then stealth. I think this will work. Well, I was right to, like, play around hoping to dodge it. I just failed. Yeah, like, fuck, I'm gonna let you escape, buddy. I'm way too mad at you to permit this. But no, I, I'm pretty sure I can do better here. If they if they get away, I'm gonna look like a chump. But you know, the captain doesn't even have the helmet. Looks like. I can start. Fifty-one scrap. That was better. I want to do that. I'll do another bar power next. Store. Let's do this and then. I don't know if I'm gonna hit that other star. Probably not actually. I just want more reactor power. Oh no! Slugs are invading! Experience. These guys are full. I believe in you, Stannis. That cloak let me just ignore those lasers. Which is really nice. like, the weapon, the enemy weapons don't charge anymore. I didn't need to drone part, I could have just cloaked. In fact, I'm going to anyway just to demonstrate and fire all those and then cloak. Yeah, that would be Mr. Grimes. So that was a waste of a drone part, but I don't think it'll matter, like I said. Thomas, you go heal, Stannis. 
technically, I suppose I wanted to be a super munchkin. Whenever I'm safe enough that I don't need my masters on the things, I could switch in some newbies for, like, backup redundant experience or something. That's just too boring. That's just the level where it's, like, the boredom this makes me cause is more likely to make mistakes than the benefit it gives you. It's so little utility for so much fucking boredom. Maybe I do hit this store. I'll see what they got. That doesn't go there, so I gotta go now. Alright, sure. I'll hit the store. 93. Maybe something cool happened. So I don't need another one of these. Hermes is strong, but I can't even afford it. I'd rather have an Artemis than an Iron Blast. Yep, this is worthless, but that's fine. Let's go. You get some free repairs hitting the end, so I'll go like this far, and then we'll do that. I'm gonna go, yeah, so I can, like, make a loop. Around. No, I have sufficient missiles. I could use missiles all the time, I think it's worthwhile. What is this? That looks dangerous. I forget how that works. The rest of this can't get through my shields, really, so. Of course, I'm not sufficient for that. Yeah, let's just. I actually haven't even used that Artemis to do it. First of all, he hits their shields. Yeah, I'll lead with an Artemis. Why not? Yeah, I'm glad I got the shield charge booster. That was a worthwhile investment. Oh my god, a third star. Let's do that then. Well, no, I'll make it. I'll make it if I do these ones. I'll make it. I believe in me. Yes, fire weapons, but no way to get to me. That, um,. Yep, we're just gonna do the first first level one of shields. Those weapons. Unless this can ignore all shields, then we'll find. Okay, one bar shield, much more acceptable. I will find out how bad his other shit is, but I... Okay. Be that way, Burger King. Not Save all my money to let that store, and then I'm gonna do my last upgrade. Okay, and my last store and upgrade for the final fight, that's what I'm gonna say. I'd better get a defense drone out for that. Let's even splurge on the good one. Thank <laughs> you. 
What? Well, that's not fucking lucky at all. Hopefully, I got enough drone parts I can do this again, but holy Christ. I just killed my. Just straight up died. Got hit by a laser. I've never seen that happen. Will I be able to hit the exit if I do this? Like, I know I'll be able to hit the store, but then will I reach the exit in time? This isn't in a nebulae, so I'm gonna just hit the store to be safe. Not do that one extra system. Well. I'm gonna get drone parts. Try to get six and double up on drones, but I got cloak too. Nope, I want all my drone parts. The last stand. Stop watching here if you're worried about. Sp Store the enemy flagship. I don't really want to waste a repair, so I'm gonna take this long way so I got all these repair stations for when I might actually need them sometime. And I just don't want to waste the store. Plus, if I do win a fight, I can afford to like try to get this to six or something. Okay, what is this? Combat drone, combat drone, combat drone, and just some missiles. Oh, I'm down. Good boredom. Don't feel like it. It's just Artemis their shields break down their drunk. Go for double drone action. I can't think of anything else better to spend my last things on, so try to grab for six drones so I can run defense one and two, and then just react to power. Okay. How do I do this? Oh, I'm immune to this guy, so. Maybe I will board him. Just try to, uh,. Artemis their shields. And let's see how much I love our five. Three. Oh, but I breached. So then let's try to kill their health. Light that on fire. And then let's uh cover some sweet rewards. Alright, dude. I got more friggin' experts here. So I'm just to get some fire off my good guy.
I wouldn't, like, if drone parts are really limited, I wouldn't do this. I don't think they are anymore, though, so I'm gonna do it. Like this. First drone. Well, if this gets rid of two bars of shield, then I'll probably shoot their weapons or drones. Otherwise, shields and shooting. Yep, and then next we'll go to... Let's try to... That mine for just leaving my pants from. He is doing work. Oh my god, I did. Oh my god, shut up. Oh god bless you, Glock. I got this item, it's no longer necessary. These are just two beams around on their shields. This is probably enough of a reactor power sink. I'm probably not gonna have, like, th that much spare, more than four. So maybe one of these subsystems? <sighs> Autopilot's kinda nice. I might grab one. Autopilot. So my, in case my captain is, needs to run or whatever, so I can get, keep dodging. I'm gonna grab doors first and autopilot next. Max doors, in case my ship gets set on fire. fight the boss. I'll be able to afford autopilot after this one. I'm not sure I'm going to spec actually. I wish I could buy more reactor power, but I got all of it. All that I can have. Let's do this one. Go. Okay, let's run. This Dodge missiles, but I'd rather just have it on like high cooldown. Like be able to use it again faster. Just he has more of a downtime than I do. Yeah, I'm pretty sure just sending in my my boarding hit squads to just teleport in and kill is a good idea. Just like sabotage these missile banks. Yeah, the 
double defense drone is not actually that horrible for me. So let's... Take the boys home. Stop using this Artemis now so I can run this up double. Next time it comes up. Now we shall... Yeah, I'm actually going to have a pretty easy time this here. I'm going to try to even leave my enemies alive still. This guy's got multiple forms, I'll spoil it for you. And so I'd rather, I think. Well, let me do this to make sure I don't kill him before I put my butt on the ship. Alright. Let's go sabotage. Yeah, the two. Actually, my shields are getting kind of low because of these ions. Let's sabotage the ions too. Three missiles. Let's turn them both on. Let's end them with that. Whatever, I can handle this. I'm gonna, I'm gonna finish off that third. We're gonna leave the beam, I think. Take out the missile bank. You don't want to kill quite everything. Maybe I can call for because this thing is like a AI that auto repairs. So you want to be careful not to kill too much, or the AI will kick in. But I'm pretty sure maybe if I can take out all four of these little banks, you don't want to kill all the crew members because then the AI will. Okay. But I think I can handle taking out all four. I kind of remember, I'm worried that all four banks might be one of the conditions for the auto AI to kick in. And we're just going to hope it isn't. Because <laughs> I don't remember. It's worth noting I can't save them when they're invisible, but it doesn't matter because I don't want to, like, I can't. I'd meet along the way. Of course. I'd 
rather just... Oh, killing those doesn't carry over, I really thought it did. Oh, that's kind of fucking pointless then. Oh, yeah, looting it. Oh well. So let's think. He's got these missile banks. He's got drones. The drones give him a special, like, drone attack. I think I'm gonna just not risk boarding anymore then. We're gonna just run this loadout. Here. I'm gonna save the cloak for his drone search. Oh wait, my Artemis is pointless though. Oops. He's got this. Next drone on my head, just... Yeah, just... Oh, here we go. We got something for these guys to do that. Not wasted. That's uh, bad, but it's not his, like, super mega drone surge, the three missiles. I think I'm just gonna live and let live. Oh, never mind. The power surge is coming, and he did three missiles, so perfect time to right now. Yeah, magic five minutes. Something I want, like, to have extra health. That's probably what I should do here. I guess I'm just gonna... I'm not gonna give a second part oxygen, just so that half doesn't kill my oxygen. Half damage. It's probably the most likely thing to kill me right now, so I'm sure. Okay. Get on! Teleporter and some kind of super weapon. Well, fine if you teleport on me. Okay, now he doesn't have a defense drone, so it's worth running the Artemis. Just let out for now. Yeah, it's fine if he's gonna use this. I'll just board him. And then if he's got some kind of super weapon, I'm just gonna save for that. Oh, really? Really? Yeah. No, I believe in you. You got this. <gasps> You're strong. Oh, there's no point delaying, because we're all just going to be hitting his ult and shield, so I want to get max efficiency instead, rather than trying to Just... I could wait for a super weapon, but that was a lot of missiles he just fired at once, so I could just cloak those and hope it's up again for whenever the super weapon comes. Yeah, if I didn't float, those would have hurt. 
but I was cloaked and it did. Cloak is really good against the final boss, if you hadn't noticed by now. I highly recommend trying to get it for that reason. And now we'll... We'll Artemis him, and we'll go like one, two, spread the love. And I want... Uh, yeah! Oh, I got distracted. Someone's knocking at the door. Um, whatever. I think I just win now. Well, I don't know if we'll go for that, though, so... Okay, so we hit me hard. So there you go! I hope the, um... <laughs> I hope that video helped you guys learn some good habits for FTL. Took it start to finish. Later.